But when disaster happens, we may send food, money, or clothes. But as KG9 on your side's Craig Smith reports, one Tucson company is saying relief groups are calling it to send body armor to Ukraine. Since the Russians invaded Ukraine, people all over America have looked for ways to try to help. And a Tucson company is offering some serious protection. This is some help that can take a bullet for you. Spartan Armor Systems uses a variety of materials to make body armor for law enforcement, military, and law-abiding civilians. The most basic can stop a slug from a handgun. But Spartan's seeing a surge in demands for some of the toughest vests they make. The vest with ricochet-resistant steel plates, able to stop a bullet from a military rifle including the rounds Russian troops use. Company president Todd Meek says some of the sales surge is U.S. residents reacting to uncertainty in the world, but a lot of the orders are going to Ukraine. Um, a lot of these people are concerned citizens and they've partnered with uh, Ukrainian relief organizations and uh, there are regulations to ship body armor overseas and they're working with those organi organizations to um, apply you know, with those export and import laws. Meeks knows many Ukrainians fighting right now are not trained soldiers. You know, in Ukraine, I know they're handing out AK-47s to civilians that haven't had any training. Um, at least with body armor, you know, it's it's a um, you know just protection that you're putting on and you're cinching up the vest. So there's there's not a lot of um, you know it's going to be helpful no matter how you wear it. He says he ships the armor to relief groups in the U.S., and they handle the tricky business of export regulations, getting the vest into Europe and on to Ukrainian fighters. I believe that we're helping, um, you know, the right side uh, of uh, what's going on over there. And so we're, we're helping out civilians and protecting them. Um, and it's one thing that they're calling out for. Um, a lot of Ukrainian Americans that have friends and family over there, they're saying we need you know, body armor, it's one of the top three things. We need ammo, we need humanitarian supplies, and we need body armor. And he knows some of the armor made here in Tucson could save the life of a Ukrainian who was a civilian just a few days ago before Russian troops invaded and forced them into the line of fire. Craig Smith, KGUN 9, on your side.